Okay, you guys, hold the Windows key in your keyboard and then R. Once you hold that, you will come up with this run. Here you are going to type services.msc and then click on OK. You will come up this way, services window. Here you are going to look for, so here it is, it's a HP hotkey, it's a UWP services and properties. So you are going to look for this. So in order to look for this, you are going to just type, uh, you are going to hold a H key in a keyboard and it will take you to all the services that starts with the H. So currently I don't have in my system. I am just guiding you the procedure, what you are going to do with this. Once you find this, it's a HP hotkey UWP services and properties. Just give a right click on that and then click on properties and then here what you are going to do is you just going to disable the services you can see here you have a, a startup type you will set it to disable and then you click on apply and then you click on ok it's a very simple so you are going to do this for these services for this particular services currently I don't have it in my PC but you are going to do this for this particular services the another way uh, after doing this uh, you are going to download and install let me show you how do you do that okay guys i have left the link down below in the video description to download it in case the link do not work at some point of time manually search for the software over the internet and download it some from some other site so it is uh, hp hotkey support give a right click on it and run as administrator you can actually find it's a permission. You can click on yes, and then you will come up with this wizard. You can see it's a SP hotkey support. Click on next. Edit terms and conditions. Click on next, next, and here it is. Okay, guys. Finally, you see installation wizard complete. Now, I hope this uh, tutorial was helpful. You're gonna try this couple of steps and. If it fixes it, it's in this video with your friends and family.